Hey guys, Big Beast 75 here. It is about 11.05 in the morning. I just got up, um, so that's why I look like crap. Anywho, I told you guys I'd give you guys my first reaction to the Wolverine trailer. And I'm looking right now, and there appears to be two. They released an international trailer and a domestic trailer. So I'm going to look at both. I'm going to look at the international trailer first. And uh, for those of you who don't know what this movie is about, it's the Marvel Comics character, the Wolverine, or Wolverine as you would normally call him. Um, this is supposed to be like biggest, baddest, in most intense Marvel movie ever made. It's from James Mangold, who if you don't know him, he directed uh, 310 to Yuma with Russell Crowe and Christian Bale, which is an absolutely amazing movie. Uh, James Mangold's a great director, so I expect great things from this movie. Um, there's not a lot of very well-known stars in this movie besides Hugh Jackman. And the fact that they're, that Jean Grey is probably returning to the, f or making a cameo in this movie. Um, but yeah, that's what the movie's about. And just him being at his lowest and you're all reach of the plot. Based on the celebrated co comic book arc, this epic action adventure takes Wolverine, the most iconic X-Men universe character, to modern day Japan. Out of his depth in an unknown world, he faces his ultimate nemesis in a life or death battle that will leave him forever changed. Vulnerable for the first time and pushed to his physical and emotional limits, he confronts not only lethal samurai steel, but also his inner struggle against his own immortality, emerging more powerful than ever before. So this is supposed to be really intense, really violent, and, you know, we'll see. Here's the first international trailer for The Wolverine. Here we go. Eternity can be a curse. The losses you have had to suffer. A man can run out of things to live for. Lose his purpose. That hurt. I wouldn't bother with them. I've been trying to find you for over a year. My employer is dying. He wants to thank you for saving his life. It's an honor to meet the Wolverine. That's not who I am anymore. I didn't send for you only to thank you, Logan. I wanted to repay you. A gift to equal the life you gave me. You have struggled long enough. Our company can do anything. I can make you mortal. <laughs> wow, okay, well, basically what happened in that trailer is they're talking about, I mean, I heard you, I'm sure you heard it, but he, they're talking about making the Wolverine mortal again, because uh, he's tired of being, uh, dealing with immortality. Um, there was a glimpse of, um, 
Jean Grey in there just to, I'm pretty sure it's a flashback. Um, you know, couldn't be, but I think it's a flashback, but there's a lot of action, really intense. Um, yeah, that was really, whoa. <laughs> I mean, didn't look like I was very interested. I, I mean, I don't, I don't know what my reaction is right now, but it was, it was pretty good. Oh, I, I, I'm impressed. I didn't, uh, I was kind of worried with the uh, six second teaser thing we were going to get and now I'm, I'm pretty I'm pretty okay now all right so now I'm going to look at the domestic trailer and there appears to be two versions one you can watch on Apple and one if you can watch on YouTube so here we go this is the domestic trailer for the Wolverine And it's very short. It's a minute and 56 seconds. So, good. I've been trying to find you for over a year. It's an honor to meet the Wolverine. That's not who I am anymore. I can end your eternity. Make you mortal. What they did to me, what I am, can't be undone. Don't be so sure. I forgot to mention this in the in the uh, international point yeah international trailer but uh, they showed a glimpse of uh, Silver Samurai Wolverine facing the Silver Samurai and you know that one looked pretty intense all the fight scenes in this trailer look really intense and this this one appears to be more of a teaser trailer I mean it's not too out there which I like I mean I I like the event if you heard this. The 22nd trailer we got yesterday that was from this trailer. I'm sure you could hear the audio similarities. Um, so that was a snippet from that trailer. Um, but no, I'm liking this. I really am. This is great. It's showing that Wolverine is going to suffer pain like no other. It appears he loses some form of immortality. I don't think he loses like everything he says in the trailer he's not healing so that's that's something um we saw we saw yukio the red-headed japanese chick um who's supposed to be like the most dangerous person in the in this mob thing i don't know anyways i i'm not sure if she's a villain or a hero but she appears to be a hero-ish. I don't know. I'm not sure. I'm I'm keeping my eye out on her. Viper is definitely in this trailer, and she appears to be removing some sort of face mask thing. And as she's doing that, Wolverine's screaming, "No!" Uh, you know, "Oh my gosh!" But you know, I don't know if that's in that scene with with Viper, or if that's just a different scene. But in this. Uh, yeah, everything looks great. Um, 
I still want to know why Wolverine is in Japan. I'm still itching to see who the X-Men cameo person is going to be. Because I know for a fact it's not Jean Grey. Because Jean Grey is dead. Unless she's going to return somehow in the end of the movie. I don't know. I don't think that's going to happen. But um, I'm hoping it's, you know, a character that will make sense. I mean, it, heck, it could be Charles Ex No, not. He's dead. <laughs> heck, Storm. I don't know. Just somebody who... You know, it, who would make sense? But it definitely looks like everything James Mandel was talking about in the trailer, how he's being pushed to his physical, emotional limits, and he's getting tired of living and finding a purpose to live, and he, apparently he's not the Wolverine anymore, or that's what they call people, that people call him. And, yeah, this is, it's looking great. Looking really great. Uh, this is easily one of my most anticipated movies of... 2013, um, next to Iron Man and Thor and Elysium and all those movies, but this one I'm really excited for because, one, you got a really good director, like a really good director, two, this is supposed to be a really dark movie, it's unlike any other Marvel movie out there, and three, it's, if it's rated R, then it's going to be really different, really different, and the fact that they're portraying Wolverine when he's at his lowest to his physical and emotional ability and they're portraying the one we know from the comics. I mean, if you don't know, this is based on, roughly based on the um, volume one of the Wolverine comic book issue. I'm going to order that real soon so I'll be able to read it and I'm excited for that. And I'm excited for this movie. Um, the Wolverine comes out July 26th? 26th, 27th? July 26th, 2013. So, get ready for that. Get excited, because I know I am. And thanks, you guys, for watching. I like doing these uh, reaction trailers. Uh, leave your comments below. Let me know what you think. Uh, subscribe and look at my YouTube videos. And check out my Facebook page and Twitter account. Uh, God bless, and I will talk to you soon. Bye.